Yo, what is up guys? Magnus Rick here, back with a new game on the channel, Shovel Knight. Now guys, I've wanted to play this game for a long time. I've had it, I bought it at the Steam Summer Sale, and never got a chance to play it. But since I'm at the house right now, and I don't have any internet, no excuse to play any other games, guys, it's gonna be Shovel Knight time. And I think we can play through the whole game uh, throughout. I've never played it before, so I'll have you guys know it's gonna be a blind run. Sorry for that, if you wanted to see an expert run, that's not what this is gonna be. I'm probably gonna die a lot. Because as far as I know, this is a difficult game. But uh, guys, I've already set up the options. Got basic stuff like screen resolution and controller setup. Uh, I had to use X Patter, so um, I was not able to get the controller running. Again, I use a D input controller, so sometimes that is a problem. But guys, I set up my account already because I didn't like my first recording. So I haven't played a single second yet. We're gonna look at uh, the story real quick, and uh, let's see what's going on here. All right. Anyway, guys, let's jump into it. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. Yeah, my first recording, uh, the audio was not like... I anyway. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. Alright, so we are in riches here. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate, when a cursed amulet brought a terrible magic. Look at those little, like, samurai guys, you see those? When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed. Shield Knight is gone. Okay, so... Yeah, I'm, I kind of want to play a Shield Knight, honestly. His spirit broken. A grieving, sh a grieving sh Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. Dude, you didn't go look after a Shield Knight? You just stopped caring? But without champions, the land was seized by a vile power. The Enchantress and her order of no quarter. <laughs> that's, that's a good one. Your old language here, guys. Now, the tower is unsealed, and devastation looms. New adventures about to begin. Yo, why did I wait all this time to, uh, go, like, fucking... What happened to Shield Knight? I thought that was my homie. Anyway, uh... Let's get shoveling! Alright, guys, so... Alright, first things first, there's a Castlevania in the background. Uh, I gotta... I've never played this game before, I haven't even jumped into this at all, so... I don't think there's a run... Okay, so our running is... This is our running. We do got this, like, momentum thing going on here, but we can't, like, hold the button down and, and run faster like in Mario or something like that. So I have seen a little bit of gameplay of this. Uh, I know you got this kind of jumping mechanic. I don't know how to do it. Okay, there you go. I, I just hold down. Okay. Well, that is a little bit uh, difficult to get used to. <laughs> he kind of just, like, can stop in midair. He doesn't have that, like, Mario movement, you know? Hey, you kind of keep your momentum. You got to... You gotta really control your guy in midair, you got all that freedom, so... It's gonna take me a second to get used to this, guys, but... You do kinda have this downwards attack, which I have seen people, um... You know, if you guys have ever played, uh, DuckTales, which I'm a big fan of. Can I... Okay, I can't jump over this either. Tough jump, okay. Uh... Okay, so I can't jump high, can... Okay, so you... <laughs> I'm trying to learn the controls as we go here, so... Ooh, man, just like DuckTales, you can actually, uh, use them as, uh, jumping pads here, so... Are those like plants at the top here? So you can you can kind of change your height of your jump depending on how hold you how hard you hold the jump button. So you know obviously higher jump you hold it longer. You gotta remember okay, we can do this as well. It'll take a second to get used to controls, guys. Again, like I said, never even touched this game. Haven't even been into the gameplay at all. Um, I know it'll be probably challenging. Gonna do some Ducktales, motherfucker. Okay, nice. And is that safe? Safe point? doesn't really tell you, but I'm assuming if I die or something, I'll get teleported back here. Uh, one great thing I know about this this game, guys, and it, it's kind of the forte of me liking VGM so much, is that I, I end up finding VGM for games I've never played before. So Shovel Knight was on that list for years now, I think. It, you know, at least a year. Uh, you know, they have some awesome tracks in this game. So it's kind of one of those retro, oh my fucking... Do those instinct kill me? I wonder. They usually do in games like this. I'm not getting even bothered uh, trying out that. Right. Oh shit! I was gonna know you were gonna do that, dude. Okay, just keep. Woo, babe! Oh, I jumped into the bubble. Okay, and he's coming forward. This is not good. I don't. I don't know the correct pattern to beat this guy. Jump! Oh, good. Oh, I ran into him. Am I dead? Nope. Still good. I'm dead now. 
Did I lose all my money? My god. Recover. I think I lose some of my money. Okay, so no lives in this game. I don't, as far as I know. Uh, we do have life. I mean, we're, we're learning on the way here, but I did lose some of my money, which I can only assume is useful for something. Uh, if it's upgrades, that's bullshit, man, because <laughs> I'm going to have to be farming or something. All right, let's go. Oh, there you go. Oh, it's like Dark Souls. I can pick up my money again. Oh, let's just do this. Why was, why was I attacking? Let's keep hitting him in the head. Dude, you're done. Get out of here, man. So simple this second time, man. Uh, so it, it kind of works like Dark Souls right there. So I'm kind of getting a DuckTales vibe here. And I'm um, getting a uh, Dark Souls vibe where we can pick up our... Dude, real? Okay, we're not jumping on him, apparently. The movement, I don't know... If... I mean, I'm gonna get used to it, obviously, but it's, it's just weird, right? Because it's not like, uh... You know, it, I wish I had, like, a run button or something. All right. Digging up all this money. Still have no idea what the money is used for. Ooh! I don't know what actually caused that, uh, catalyst there. I guess just kind of... If terrain's in the way, fucking... What? Slimes? Are you real? Slimes did not, uh, were not conductive of, of bouncing on them. Alright. Okay. You always see these things over there. Okay, I think I see what it is. And it's explosive over there. Explosive. I'm gonna go over it. No, don't knock me in the... Ooh, motherfucker. I saw that. Okay, we got a musical note. I don't wanna fuck with... I don't want these skulls or something. <laughs> you know, they're gonna do some kind of tricks or something. These skulls are gonna come to life and kill me or something. We got a musical note. I don't know if that's like bonus stuff or something I'll need later. Who knows? Better I get it now than have to backtrack here later, so. Um, this is kind of like one of those, uh. What, how do I say? Like learning. Oh, God. Well, I guess I'm not getting that. Uh, learning experiences that, uh, you know, you might be able to get more out of this game the, the second or the, the more times you play it, you know, you know what's gonna come out of it, so. This first playthrough guys again I remind you guys it's totally blind so just cut me some slack if I don't like 100% this game or something. Ooh chicken! Well that was more like a giant turkey or something. Liking it, liking it. Oh shit. Okay yeah give me that. My ass is gonna bump it. I'm still kind of wondering if I'm gonna die if I touch a, a spike or not or if I just take damage. Get out of here dude. I, you know I might need him later for a jump I had to make or something. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna make this trek over here. I don't know how useful the money is right now, but... Oh, penis. Okay. <laughs> I see why the, the dragon might have been helpful. You have nothing to lose but your sanity here, Rick. Ugh! Come on! Can I just make it from here? How important is that coin in, in all honesty? Okay, no. Just don't fall. Just get the coin. I didn't even see this over here. Of course I'm gonna go over here. Oh shit, I'm gonna die in hell. Let's go! Dude, you gotta go the first time. You just gotta go. The bravery must be there. You're a shovel knight. Of course you gotta get the... Dude, how am I gonna get back? Okay. I was like, I'm dead. They set me up for failure. Okay. We're good though. We're good. Got the musical note. And fucking, we don't know what it's for. Nobody at all has told us yet, so... Enemies do seem to respawn here, so... Get wrecked. Okay. Fuck you, dragon. I don't need you. I don't need you. Oh! Skeleton warrior in there. Get out of here, dude. Okay, now I'm starting to get uh, a feel for the controls a little bit, guys, so that's nice. Oh, is there a downwards path I just neglected or something? Secret path? Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh! Okay, that one didn't have one of those, like, very obviously marked things there, so I didn't really... That wasn't my fault. Okay, nice. I don't know if those, like, purple gems seem to be worth the most or something, so... I don't know if they're just, uh, collectibles or they're actually just, you know, important because they have a lot of money. This looks like a Mega Man jump if ever I've seen it. Mega Man X, like, oh yeah, if you go over there and you shoot the wall while you're going down the pit, then you get the secret shit. It's like, oh god. You see, this would be very helpful if I knew, you know, second playthroughs and stuff, if I knew which kind of walls were breakable. As if any of them were that important. I wonder if I can do the trick on him. Oh! I'm actually a little scared to do the trick on him because I mistimed that and I'm gonna go in the pit. Screw it, just just make sure I don't overstay my welcome here. Once he's dead, okay. I don't have anything to bounce on. No, my money! Oh, me! Oh, <laughs> shit! Okay, well, we're going back. And we lost hella money right there. But I think. Do we have to kill the boss again? That would be a bummer. 
Well, we lost a lot of money killing that boss in the first place because it just dropped it all the way down the pit for no reason. That they knew I was gonna do that. They're like, jump on, jump on the dragon's head again, Rick. Just do it. I fucking dare you. There's no money. That's not all of it though. There's only two coins out of the three. I think I legit lost some this time. Okay, don't fall down the pit, please. Oh, it, it didn't even drop it. Okay, well, I guess that kind of um, is a way to deter people from trying to farm on... This guy is just Castlevania as fuck, or Ninja Gaiden as fuck. Look at him. If I run over there, he's going to like try to push me in the pit. You piece of... Sh Ooh, I was this close. I was this close. Man, that was lucky, guys. Here's a tight jump. Ooh, okay, I was not confident in my jumping ability right there. All right, guys, so let's push some buttons here. We got our inventory... Um, I know there was something with like up and something about relics where I have to press up and like I don't know be, be able to change relics on the fly or something like that. I don't think we have any relics yet, whatever that is. So. Come on, give me some money. I'm, I'm a shovel knight. Give me some money. Look at these. The fucks are hidden. You think you're slick? I saw you. Better not blow up a wall just yet. I think I think this is a wall we can blow up, but then it'll leave us trapped down here, and we're gonna have to go home. Refrain from doing that. Let's go over here. There's probably a musical note at the end of this season. Again, I have no idea what the musical notes are for. Okay, and there's our, our pink gem. It's a lot of gold. Probably gonna fucking die and lose it all. Whoa, okay, it was not counting that jump! Alright. Man, there will come a time where I'll be so good at this game I don't even freaking think about it, but right now it's just like all that's on my mind, so. Okay. Four. Checkpoints. We died twice already. What do we got here? Black Knight. I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The Cerulean coward. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing here for you anymore. Stand aside, Black Knight. I have no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate. Your time away has dulled your senses, can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress, and her invincible knights of the Order of No Quarter stand between you and the Tower. But none of that matters, because any anyone after the Enchantress has to go through me. Steal thy shovel. Man, I love it. Does he have a shovel too? Oh shit, we both have shovels. Ah, you were no match for my jump, but- Oh shit, he has a jump attack! Look at this, fuck is cheating now! Okay, he's just copying my attack. Look, oh my god, I'm gonna get fucked up. That's what you get for laughing, dude. The hubris is real. I'm scared to- when he just runs up to you, it's like... Okay, this attack is just gonna bump me up. I'm not even gonna try to counter it. Yeah. He tried! Okay, now now I understand. He's gonna take many jumps on his head to really kill him. Isn't he? And he's taking... Yep, goodbye, life. <laughs> okay, let's try that one more time. Um, I think I understand. He has a few attacks here, and the, when he jump attacks, I think it's probably just best to avoid him. I don't know if I can counter attack him or not. So. The laugh is real, man. You can tell that the creators uh, at the Yacht Games really uh, gave attention to trying to make this seem really Castlevania-like or Ninja Gaiden-like. So. And I can really appreciate that. I really do. So. You can just dodge this jump with that. Can I counterattack him? That's the Ooh, you can. Okay, nice. So everything he does, you can indeed outskill him, basically. He tries to... Oh, I, did, I just didn't jump! Okay. Timing. Ooh, I was trying to timing him. Ooh, there it is. Ooh, he got him. Shut your ass up. Ooh, got him with the jump attack, baby. Just jump over this. Yeah, yeah, see, I was scared about that. I was like, if I jump it, he jumps at the same time. We're both gonna just run into each other. I wanna get, like, a DuckTales combo on him. Okay, one more, or two more hits, right? Let's get him on that fourth hit again. Mm. Oh, tried it. Bad idea, but I tried it. He's gonna die. I guarantee it. After... Ooh, shit. How close are we? He's, he's being the counter. He, he's doing this little bait attack. Ooh, what a jump back. <gasps> what? Dude, I had to get him one more time. Okay, get him with a basic attack. Jesus, he almost came back with him, that. He raised my shovel. In victory, baby. I've done it. I lost a lot of gold, I think. I, I died multiple times. Oh, shit, I thought he was gonna get me. Okay. That would have been a good time, Black Knight. Just saying. While I'm cheering right there, you hit me upside the head. Just saying. But a true knight has honor, guys. So, anyway, guys, that was the first stage. I have no idea how this is going to work out. Obviously, it looks a lot like 
you know, your Castlevania, your Mega Man type game. Uh, it plays a lot like it has stages, so my guess is... Oh, shit! What's this? You just gonna fall out of the sky like this? Shield Knight? Catch her. I'm coming! I'm coming! Wait! I got her! Right? Did I have to jump? Aww. I didn't even realize it was a girl knight. <laughs> I, I, and somebody did mention this to me. They're like, Rick, you gotta play this game because I have this chick that's a, a shield knight. I didn't realize until right then that I, for, I forgot that it was a... Oh, shit. I have to get up? Oh, I have to get up. Am I done here? It's like I woke up from a bad dream, guys. So. Planes clear. Oh, man. It's like... It's like Super Mario uh, 3. We got a world map and everything, guys. So my guess is that's a boss up there. We got a couple bosses. I don't know how big the world map is, but... Guys, we only beat the first stage. We're probably going to have to extend our videos a little bit if we want to beat this game in a timely in timely manner. I'll do a little bit of research for how long the video should be, guys. But that is the first episode of Shovel Knight. I appreciate everybody watching. And in the next video, guys, we're just going to go into the village and find out some more stuff about this game, guys. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I will catch you guys oh, later.